This video demonstrates how to set up and perform an ultrasound examination of the first trimester of pregnancy. Equipment required includes the following. An ultrasound machine, a selection of transducers, an adjustable examination table, preferably a gynecology examination couch, positioning aids such as pillows or wedges, an ergonomically adjustable chair, and a chair for the partner or companion of the patient acoustic gel, and sterile gel, which is used for the endovaginal scan or if the patient is allergic to regular gel, an endovaginal transducer probe cover or condoms, examination gloves, tissues, sanitary towels, a wet towel or wipe, bed linen, and a sonographer's worksheet. Select the appropriate transducer for the first trimester transabdominal examination. Select the standard preset for first trimester sonography. Introduce yourself to the patient. Explain the procedure and likely duration. Obtain informed verbal consent. Ask the patient if she would like someone to remain with her during the scan. Confirm the patient's details and obtain a medical and obstetric history. Check the patient has a full bladder and is in a gown. Explain why and how manual pressure may be applied during the examination. Ask the patient to lie on the examination table. Ensure her comfort using pillows or foam wedges. Enter the patient details and last normal menstrual period or estimated date of delivery into the ultrasound machine. Expose the lower abdomen and apply gel as required. Select the appropriate transducer. Confirm the correct preset. Perform a survey scan of the pelvis. Be aware of the scan planes, terminology, and scan protocols used by your department. Remember the maternal and embryo scan planes are independent of each other. First examine the pelvis in longitudinal and transverse planes, freezing, annotating, and saving images of the uterus including the endometrium, cervix, and vagina, and noting whether a gestation sac is present in the uterus. Note any variations in the shape or position of the uterus and measure its maximum width. Also, scan the right and left ovaries and obtain images in longitudinal and transverse planes, including measurement. Calculate the ovarian volume. Note if a corpus luteum is present. Place the transducer perpendicular to the anterior abdomen in the midline, just superior to the symphysis pubis. Commence scanning in the longitudinal plane. Sweep, slide, or rock the transducer to obtain a suitable image of the...